Trucks carrying what appears to be carrying at least nine ASCOD2 Sabre light tanks was spotted recently in a highway somewhere in Luzon. After initial reports of the same tanks being unloaded from a commercial cargo ship in Subic Freeport. The Philippine Army PA, is expected to receive 20 new Israeli defense manufacturer Elbit Systems land Sabre ASCOD tracked light tanks which are expected to greatly enhance its armor capabilities. In a message Thursday night, Colonel Xerxes Trinidad, PA spokesperson, said these armored vehicles are part of the Army's light tank acquisition project under Horizon 2 of the revised Armed Forces Modernization Program RAFPMP. As part of the light tank acquisition project under the Horizon 2 of the revised AFP Modernization Program RAFPMP, the 20 units of Sabra ASCOD tracked light tanks are expected to be delivered this year, he said. Asked how these light tanks will be organized once they are delivered, Trinidad said these vehicles will comprise the planned 1st Tank Battalion of the PA Armor Division. These armored vehicles are mounted with 105mm cannons. As to their organization, the tanks will be organic to the proposed activation of 1st Tank Battalion of the Armor Division to compose the first modern light tank fleet of the PA, he said. The contract is worth around 9.4 billion Philippine pesos and was acquired via government-to-government -government mode. Previously, the Philippine Army has received a Sabra ASCOD2 light tank from Israel's Elbit Systems. In a social media post, the Philippine Army's Armor Division AD, said that it has received one Sabra light tank based on the ASCOD platform and the tank will be used by the 1st Tank Battalion of the AD. The tank is equipped with a 105mm main armament cannon, a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun, and a fully electric turret drive, the AD said. The tank provides ballistic protection of up to NATO standardization agreement, STANAG, 4569 Level 4. The Sabre light tank further improved the ad's capabilities in providing lethal firepower for both internal and external security operations, the AD added. The rest of these assets will arrive in early 2023, which is composed of wheeled and tracked Sabre light tanks that would beef up the 1st Tank Battalion's fleet of armored vehicles, the AD continued. In January 2022, Colonel Xerxes Trinidad, the Philippine Army's official spokesperson, told Jaynes that the service had ordered 20 tracked Sabre ASCOD-2 light tanks and 10 wheeled Sabre Pander-2 direct fire support vehicles from Elbit. In January 2021, Elbit also announced that an Asia-Pacific country had ordered Sabre vehicles worth US$172 million. Previously, the Israeli company Elbit Systems has won a US$196 million contract to produce and supply the Sabre 105mm light tank based on General Dynamics European Land Systems GDELS, tracked platform ASCOD2 and wheeled platform Pander2. According to Elbit, the Sabre light tank series is based on a tracked or wheeled platform, as part of Elbit Systems' global cooperation with Tier 1 military platform manufacturers. Due to ongoing development and technology insertion, the ASCOD offers advanced protection and mobility, large internal volume at very compact dimensions, and a large payload at low GVW, Elbit said. The chassis provides the ASCOD with its mobility, mine protection characteristics and acts as the interface for all other primary subsystems. The Pander offers a unique solution of wheel suspensions characterized by robust chassis components, optimum riding comfort and minimum maintenance effort, Elbit noted. All tanks will be armed with a 105mm cannon and equipped with the E-Lynx and Torch X systems. According to ArmyRecognition.com, the 105mm gun system is equipped with an automatic loading system with 12 rounds ready to fire. The vehicle carries a total of 36 ammunition, with 24 rounds stored in the hull. The gun can fire a wide range of NATO ammunition including HEP-T, High Explosive, HESH, High Explosive Squash Head, APFSDS, Armor-Piercing Fin Stabilized Discarding Sabot, 
as well as advanced ammunition, TMP He M110. The 105mm gun has an effective firing range of 3,600 meters with a rate of fire of 6 rounds per minute. Per the contract, the Philippine Army will receive 8 Sabra tanks based on ASCOD-2, 10 Sabra tanks based on Pander-2, 1 Command Vehicle ASCOD-2, Armored Command Vehicle, 1 ARV based on ASCOD-2, Armored Recovery Vehicle. In addition, Elbit is also responsible for the supply of 28 Iveco Guarani wheeled armored personnel carriers, 6 times 6, in the amount of $47 million. All armored personnel carriers are equipped with turrets with a 12.7mm machine gun and a 40mm grenade launcher. There is also the option of installing a remotely controlled turret with a 12.7mm machine gun.